In this video, we will set up a report in Excel that will send values from Excel into SysCAD. So the keyword is SysCAD underscore set tag list. If I open brackets, we can give our report a name. And again, you can give the report any name at all. Do we want the SysCAD tags to be horizontally, so going across the columns, or vertically going down the rows? I'm going to use a vertical list, so I'll say V, and then how many rows must it look down? And the, the number of rows can be more than the values that you have, but definitely not less. So for this one, I'll just say 10, and then close bracket. If I open my SysCAD report, the first thing I'll say is the all feed rate. So if I right click on the feeder, and I pick up the QM required, the mass flow required. Copy that full tag, and paste that in. I'll go pick up another value from SysCAD, and this time I could pick up the set point. And this is the temperature that we're running the autoclave at. Or I say Control C. Back into Excel, and Control V to paste that. And in the same way, I can pick up a number of other tags. So you'll see I've copied four tags in there. And it's very important that the value that you want to put into the tag is in the column directly next to the tag. So a mistake I could make is to type in the value here into column F. A good idea is always to make your column that your tags are in the same width as the tags. And then we'll see we have to put the values into column D. So the all feed rate required, I could say I want that to be 65 tons an hour. Steam control set point, this is my temperature of my autoclave, 165. Auto control ratio, 2.3. Acid control set point, I know that's the grams per litre coming out of the autoclave, we make that 3. I'll save that report, and in the next exercise, we'll go and see how you can use this report to send the values into SysCAD.